It's rare to have the privilege of playing an entire career with one organization. I'm proud to be one of the few, but even more so that it was as a giant. Eli Manning, who's best known as a star NFL quarterback and younger brother of Peyton Manning, has been able to snag some pretty luxurious real estate in New Jersey. Manning recently listed his mansion in Summit, New Jersey for $5.25 million, which they originally had purchased in 2014 and was renovated the following year. After retiring from the NFL, Manning also sold his slick Hoboken, New Jersey condo for a record price of $3.5 million after he originally put it on the market for $5.2 million. However, the $3.5 million sale was reportedly the highest ever paid for a condo in the city. Those Mannings really know how to break records. We'll take a look at the lavish homes Eli has owned throughout his lucrative NFL career, including his former dig, which boasted beautiful views of the Hudson River, and his most recent matchup, which features 9,000 square feet of interior space and a whopping eight fireplaces. Eli has really proven that his real estate portfolio may be better than the Mannings. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, so please do not show up at any private residences because it is not safe for anyone. It's a learning process, and, and, and really the best way to learn is to get that experience, make those mistakes and you learn from the mistakes. Throughout Eli's lucrative NFL career, he had managed to accumulate a net worth of $150 million. Uh, all right, that one right. bad. All right, that's good. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you ducked? All right, you can throw it now, Eli. One more, one more. <laughs> Having played his entire 16-year career for the New York Giants, he officially retired from the NFL in January of 2020. At the time of his retirement, he was the highest earning player in league history, with career earnings of $252 million in salary alone. Not too shabby, if I should say so myself. Originally, Eli Manning and his father publicly stated that he would refuse to play for the charges if drafted by them. So after they had drafted him first overall, they traded him to the New York Giants, and he went on to sign his first NFL contract for six years at $45 million. It turned out to be a pretty good move for Eli as he went on to win two Super Bowls and was named the Super Bowl MVP twice. While making bank through his career on the field, off the field, Manning was one of the highest paid celebrity endorsers in the world during his professional career. He regularly earned eight to 10 million per year, promoting brands like Gatorade, DirecTV, Toyota, Reebok, Kraft, Citizen, and Samsung. He also co-starred in campaigns with his brother Peyton for NFLshop.com and Oreo. Additionally, Eli, Peyton, and Archie Manning got together and co-authored the children's book, Family Huddle, which tells the story of the three Manning brothers playing football together growing up. Isn't that so sweet? Such a tight-knit family. As a result of his career earnings, along with endorsements, Manning was able to snag luxurious homes throughout New Jersey. Seriously, these houses are a thing of beauty. Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Marlon Palmer, and today we're bringing you another house tour here for you on Famous Entertainment. I noticed 95% of you guys watching are not subscribed, so please be sure to hit that subscribe button. We post videos literally every day. Now, we've previously reported on the homes of Keith Urban and Kylie Jenner, so if you guys would like to check those out, please do so. And as well, follow me on Instagram at that McFly. So we could chat some more. If you like these videos, ring that bell for the notifications and let's get into the video. You can be confident that no one has loved and appreciated wearing the Giants uniform more than I have and that will never change. After retiring in January of 2020, Eli Manning sold a record-breaking condo in Hoboken, New Jersey for $3.5 million. Manning's apartment was originally listed for $5.2 million three years ago, and at one point in 2016, Manning sought a renter for his unit at the Hudson T condo for a whopping $18,000 a month. Regardless, his $3.5 million estate has the highest ever paid for condo in the city. So what does that kind of scratch get you? The lavish 3,500 square foot condo was tailor-made for Eli, and the lofty residence features three bedrooms and three and a half bathrooms over two separate wings. It's trimmed with fabulous custom cabinetry and an eaten kitchen with dining booth, box beam ceilings, and a huge window which boasts spectacular views overlooking the Hudson River and the New York City skyline. The master wing offers direct east views from the main bedroom and adjacent study. The guest wing includes two bedrooms, a playroom for the young Mannings, and an office where Eli probably signed a massive contract or two. The house features with two full bathrooms and a laundry center and also comes complete with a concierge, fitness, and business center. The living space features the most elegant furnishings oak, wood cabinets, unique antiques and paintings along with an oversized window that gives the room an airy and roomy ambiance. The kitchen is trimmed with fabulous custom cabinetry and features classic subway tiles in the kitchen, elegant marble countertops, and an eaten kitchen with dining booth and a handy banquet. The pad has box beam ceilings throughout and the master suite features more lavish furnishings, easy access to the spacious bathroom that comes complete with an enormous shower and soak-in tub. While Eli and his wife Abby McGrew Manning have four children, their condo is also family friendly, 
completely decked out with furnishings, artwork, and lots and lots of toys. See, this place has everything for the family. Eli Manning and his large family upgraded to a Summit, New Jersey mansion in 2014 when he purchased the property for $4.7 million and it was since renovated in 2015. The house built in 1904 in the Georgian Revival style has 9,000 square feet of interior space and sits on 1.1 acres of land. This upgrade includes a whopping eight fireplaces and boasts five full bathrooms, four half bathrooms, and Eli's own personal home gym. Good to know that Eli still knows how to work hard and play hard. With six bedrooms, five full bathrooms, and four and a half bathrooms, the house has space enough for an entire entire team. The full layout includes a fireside dining room, a sun-filled formal living room, and an oversized family room perfect for his large family. A gourmet kitchen with high-end appliances, marble countertops, and an elegant kitchen island which looks too cozy for a breakfast room. The spacious master suite has two dressing rooms and a marble bath perfect for those lucky enough to visit the Manning's house. Other amenities include a choice between eight restored fireplaces, a home office to sign those endorsement deals, and a third floor bonus room that could be turned into a rec room or six bedroom. The house also features a Christian central control system and a generator for emergency backup power just in case you may blow a fuse hosting a team party or whatever. Perhaps one of the coolest features includes a 750 bottle wine cellar for those who fancy a Chardonnay. Probably the most relaxing spot on the 1.1 acre land is found in the backyard which features a massive gray yard and manicured trimmings perfect for Eli if you want to just pass around the old pigskin again. For the kids we have a charming little playground that was installed with plenty of room to run around. The lavish backyard also features an enormous pool with a recently renovated pool house. For those that want to work on their golf game the temperature controlled pool houses features a golf simulator for use year round. Outside the patio area includes a barbecue for warm weather cookouts, perfect for the family or a Manning reunion. While there wasn't a lot of information found on Eli Manning's summer home in Cog, New York, we can tell you that he purchased a Hamptons beach house for $8.5 million. The Hamptons house, which spans 7,000 square feet, was acquired in an off-market deal and comes with plenty of space for Manning and his young family to play this summer. The property boasts five bedrooms, a pool, and a large deck that leads to the beach. Not too shabby when you retire with some beachfront property. All right, so I think I'll bring this house tour to an and here we got to take a quick look at Eli Manning's home and that massive pad in Summit, New Jersey with its own golf simulator. After seeing that fancy little house he snagged, what did you guys think? Was it everything you would expect out of the Manning residence? Personally, I would love to take a tour of that 750 bottle wine cellar, you know, drink a one, two, then try my luck at driving in the golf simulator. Out of all of his features, which ones were your faves? You guys can go ahead and rate them in the comments down below and also let us know whose house tour you guys would like to see us do next. I'll see you guys next video.